What's going on everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to get into the diagnostic mode on this 2007 Yamaha FZ6. This is what you would do if you had a fault code and you wanted to try and see what the sensor is showing or what information the sensor is displaying. It's a pretty easy process, but you just got to know how to do it. Let me know in the comments down below if there's a particular fault code you want me to look into in extra detail. Let's get into it. One of the first things the manual tells you to do before going into diagnostic mode is to disconnect your electrical connections to your fuel pump, supposedly so that you don't turn on your fuel pump accidentally or a couple times while in diagnostic mode. So if you're going to do that, you take out your two plastics, lift up your tank with the four millimeters at the front, and then undo your electrical connection. You don't have to take the tank all the way off, but you should disconnect it. This won't prevent you from getting into diagnostic mode, but it's recommended in the manual, so probably best to do it. With that in mind, now what you do is you make sure your ignition switch is in off, your kill switch is in run, and what you do is you hold down the reset and select button before you turn on your ignition, and you're gonna hold it down until the screen changes. So pressing both, turned it to on, and in just a moment here, we're gonna see the screen change. There we go, it says D1 or Diag, diagnostic. You're going to press the reset select button twice, sorry, again for two seconds. That confirms you're in diagnostic mode now. Now that you're there, you can turn off your ignition or your um, kill switch. And now you can scroll through the diagnostic modes or the, di the sensors in diagnostic mode. Select will send you up and reset will send you down. The very first one here is your throttle position sensor and you can adjust it and see it change on the screen as you roll your throttle back and forth like I'm doing. Uh, so select sends you up. The numbers here aren't labeled on the screen, but I'll attach pictures to the factory service manual at the end of the video so that you can try and see it on the screen. But otherwise you cross-reference these to a service manual and that'll tell you what's wrong and basically this will tell you what the sensor value is. And then to get out of diagnostic mode, you just turn your ignition to off and you're out. Next time you turn the bike back on, you don't have to do anything special. Just turn it on and you'll be in your regular mode simple as that. Well, that's a wrap on the diagnostic mode on the FZ6. Let me know if you had any trouble following instructions or getting into the diagnostic mode, but it's pretty straightforward. Hope you guys don't have any trouble with it. Wishing you the best of health for all your FZ6 and hope you guys are doing well. As always, please smash the like and subscribe button down below. Really appreciate it if you do. And as always, have a good day.